Yo, what's up guys? The insane game freak here to shit my hair. What the fuck? Ah. Ah. Anyways. Uh, this is my Pokemon Best Wishes Season 2 Episode 22 review. Um, let me put this microphone down because I need to clap my hands. Good fight. Good fight. Good fucking fight. Ah, I like that fight. No bullshit. The Stefan fight. Really good fight. I might have got my mom's attention. No, mom, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm fucking crazy. But seriously, good fight. Seriously, I I have no problems with this fight at all. What was it? Levani, uh, Crocodile. And Palpatine versus Zebra Striker, which I'm pretty sure I can't. What's his English name? Ah, fuck it. Zebra Striker, uh, Le Leopard, or Leopard, and uh, Sock. No problems. I feel like each one of those Pokemon on both sides went in. Palpatine. I even like that whole Ash is like, oh, I did some off-screen training shit. Usually. Usually, I'm like, fuck it, but considering this gen, he's had a whole bunch of different, he's had more than six, I don't mind off-screen training for any of them, because Levani was dodging soft like a beast, we got to see what fucking, um, I think we got to see, for, for, was it, is it Facade or Fakade, I don't know how to pronounce it, but Fakade in action, which I think we've seen before, honestly, but it's still nice to see it again, uh, we we got to see low sweep in action because they, I even like the way low sweep affected Levani because it's like technically low sweep is supposed to decrease defense not not defense de decrease speed which is how Levani was dodging sock Levani went in Palpito went in Crocodile went in and the aerial ace at the end I thought was good shit purely because he's no because Crocodile can technically learn aerial ace and it's kind of cool to see a Pokemon. That isn't a flying type. Use aerial ways. And he calls on the shit. He calls on the shit out of Sock. It was like. It was like. Aerial ways. And they were like. What? That's a flying move. And you just see Crooked Eye. Nigga runs up. Jumps. Comes back. Boom. I was like. Alright. Good fight. Good fight. Good fight sir. I might be getting my mom's attention with the clapping. But just. It was a good fight dude. Really good fight. I have no complaints with that fight. And then obviously he's fighting go Tetsu Nets next, which I believe this is, and this is the six on six battle. And we know how it's going to start with Hydreigon. Um, I don't remember the preview off the top of my head, but I think he ends up using, I know he's using Pikachu, he's using Uz, Un, <laughs> is it Uns Fezzik? Because people were telling me in, in the uh, videos I uploaded today, the uh, episode reviews I uploaded today. That I'm pronouncing his name wrong. Is it Un Pheasant? Because it's U N Uns Pheasant? I'm I'm sorry. <laughs> so we're actually gonna get to see Uns Pheasant go in. Uh who else? Off the top of my head, uh Boldor's coming back. And, and Oshawa's actually fighting. Yay! Yay! Snivy's going in, and I think Pig Knight. So it's probably Pikachu, Snivy, Pig Knight. Uh, Oshawott, uh, Boldor, and Un Pheasant. Which, ironically, I think is. I, th I think the only thing I'm, I'm a little sad is that they're not using Scraggy. I think that's my only disappointment. And I may be missing the things in the preview, but I'm gonna see that actually. I'm gonna watch that actually right now, actually. So, uh, but god damn, though. Good fight. Stefan's fight was good. I have no problems with that fight. I, I don't, I can't see anyone having a problem with that fight. That fight had a good, I heard Glory Cross had an issue with, uh, he was like, he was f venting like a motherfucker about the trip fight, which I'm kind of neutral with. I can see why people don't like it, but for me, I'm just, it's okay for me. Uh, but the Stefan fight is good, and he just said he had mixed feelings about the league overall, meaning... I'm betting Stefan's fight was good. I, I don't see anyone really complaining about that fight. Whether uh, Kotetsu's fight is good is a different story. We'll see. 
it looks like it's gonna be pretty good. And besides, I, I, I at this point, I don't have a problem with those two fighting. Um, if the if I remember right, the outcome is the spoiler ending, but we'll see, we'll see. But overall, good episodes. Good, I mean, good episode. Uh, and I'm about to go watch Kotetsu versus Ash, and we'll see how that goes. I even like Bianca. Bianca hasn't been annoying at all. Bianca's been fine. The only other thing I'm going to be disappointed about is the Virgil stuff because I actually do like Virgil. So if I'm right about how this ends, then yeah, I'm a little disappointed about Virgil. But we'll see. Anyways, this has been the the insane game free last game for the win. Please thank you. Uh, please. What am I saying? Please for. Thank you. That's what I meant to say. Thank you. For watching and catching up with these videos with me because I know I'm technically like weeks behind and where if you guys are watching the Raws and shit I think to next this week it's either like the next two episodes or at least the next episode is like the last league episode but overall I great fight I have no problems with that fight and yeah thank you guys for watching thank you guys for the support uh please leave your there there we go please leave your comments in uh thoughts and video responses in the comment section below this has been the insane game free lots of gameplay to win gotta catch them all and i'll catch you guys later sorry for the randomness and sorry for all the clapping peace